your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Chad Evans. Weather from where you live. Well, this is looking like the coldest night since April the 9th. When we dropped to 30 degrees here at WLFI in the upper 20s in our northern counties, a widespread freeze expected through the entire viewing area with a widespread heavy frost. We're already down to 37 at Winnemac, 35 at Morocco. A little frost already forming up here. 38 at Marianne's there in Remington, 39 Burlington, and 40 at Lafayette. Mike Cleft just said it is really cold out there tonight, and it, it feels more like March rather than later April. But is this normal? Well, actually, it is. The average last occurrence of 32 degrees from Fowler and Lafayette down to Frankfurt and Peru is between April 29th and May the 4th. This is 30 years of data. Uh, Rochester over to Francisville, Madariville, Winnemac, and up towards Wheatfield about May 4th through the 9th. And finally, Crawfordsville, Vetersburg, Pence, and near the Boswell, uh, Boswell area, April 24th through the 29th. Now, the average last occurrence of mid-30s, this is a very light patchy frost, is around May 4th through the 9th over a good chunk of the area from Frankfurt to Lafayette to Pence and Fowler. Then as you head north, it's about May 9th to 14th with the coldest here in the far north where in some places as late as May 19th when you have your last occurrence of mid-30s. But tonight, though, widespread freeze, 30 Rochester to Logansport, 28 Winnemac, 27 Morocco, 31 Attica and Lafayette and Crawfordsville. Certainly cover those sensitive plants because they will be damaged by this frosty night tonight. There could be a little patchy, shallow fog in a few places, especially low areas and bodies of water tonight. 63 for the high tomorrow in Lafayette, 62 Monticello, 61 Rochester. Nice looking day, a lot of sunshine. And another cold night tomorrow night, but not nearly as cold as tonight. A little frost here in the northeast with 32 at Rochester, but near 40 at Attica and Pence. And those readings will likely occur around 3 a.m., then the temperature rises. And we're headed for 76 windy degrees on Thursday. You know, it's going to be 30 or so tonight, 82 on Friday with a strong southwest wind. Weakening line of severe storms will pass through Friday night, early Saturday. Not too worried about any severe weather here. And then we may get a bit of a break later Saturday into Sunday before another round of showers and thunderstorms arrive on Monday. And we could get down 35 to 40 degrees at night by the middle of next week with highs running in the mid-60s. There's that nice day, 63 tomorrow, 76 windy degrees on Thursday. Winds could gust to 35 miles an hour, but low 80s on Friday. Yeah, it's, it's Indiana, you know, 30 tonight, 82 on Friday. And then some showers and storms uh, Friday night and early Saturday. And those storms may train a little bit, so some areas may get over an inch of rain Friday night, early Saturday. But a very